I mean, this uh, background behind Amber right now looks a little moody, Amber. Oh, I know. Is that one of the Long Beach fans? It's a foggy vibe over I want here. Amber to do her whole forecast <laughs> and Usher songs. You and have Usher to give me a heads up. Yeah, I can only, that's true. I can only give you, you know, like, if you, you got it bad and, you know, confessions. What else? You want <laughs> And then, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, I think you're going to say yeah, though, especially, Chris, if, to some of our forecast highs as we head into the next few days. Okay, but let's talk about what he doesn't really like to talk about because we fall back this weekend. So that means we start to lose some daylight. So our sunrise this morning, 714, with sunset times at 559. But once we change the clocks back as daylight saving time ends, the sunrise will be a little earlier, 616. But the sunset is a little earlier as well. It's at 456, so it gets darker earlier. Um, we do have some patchy little clouds and fog, and that's because the sea breeze returned yesterday. So it's bringing back a little bit more of that marine influence. In fact, Fernando, uh, our TOC supervisor, he was saying, that he, as he's driving out of the South Bay, he hit some really dense fog, and then it kind of cleared up when he hit the 405 and the 91. So, yeah, you can see how our microclimates are working. We have a little bit of that fog moving in, but it will become more widespread as we head into this upcoming weekend. So, chilly morning, grab your layers. By the time we head into the afternoon, same drills what we've had the last few days: warm afternoons, cooler nights. But with that marine layer returning, we're going to start to see a lot more of the fog starting to push in, especially from the coast, and then it could spread inland over the course of the next few. Days. Significant cooling trend though at the start of next week because of a system that's dropping in from the north. But right now, let's talk about our temperatures. We have frosty conditions for the Lancaster area 34 degrees, 46 for Wrightwood, 55 for downtown LA. And then here's a look at that frost advisory expiring at 8 a.m. Okay, it's Friday, so if you want to get out of town, here's a quick look at your weekend forecast where it's actually going to be toasty as you get away from Southern California.